anyway, my guys go in there, and and at first I think I lost the city or something like that because Rasputin, because this other guy, and 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 the soldiers actually say, well, actually your guy has died like a week ago, or your guy is dead on the ground right there. Um, but he wasn't taking care of the town; he was just taking from the town. Um, he wasn't taking care of the town; he was ta just taking ta taking over the town or whatever, you know. And and because like. Um, Rasputin is sending, Rasputin was writing letters to the consulate, you know, saying that he was doing this and doing that and doing this and doing that and everything was fine and blah, blah, blah. And he had actually killed my mayor that was in the town, only we didn't know for like six months or a couple of years or five years or something or 30 years until, or 10 years or something like that. It was like five years or 10 years when, when he was... He had killed a bunch of people in the town and taken it over, and and the and we didn't notice right away. So and then later on we do notice, and then we go in there, and like I say, he was killing the investigators and the police people, and so he was basically the law, the mayor, everything. But it was just that nobody had actually really noticed that there was no law or whatever anyway. And then the Irish and everybody else come in. Like I say, all the all the normal people come in and because they're gonna they're going to do the job. Like I say, I love the Irish, by the way. If I give a call to an Irishman and say and say, hey, could you put in a sewer, uh, put in a, a sewer system for me over here? An Irishman is going to go there and he is going to put in that sewer. That, that, that's the thing about the Irishman. You, you, know, you ask an Irishman to go put in a sewer system somewhere and he is going to go there and he is going to put in that sewer system. Regardless. Like guaranteed. <laughs> and if he has to buy guns to defend himself, he will. <laughs> I love you, you, you know that that's that's something that people don't understand about the Irish. You know, if if you go up to an Irishman and you say, "Hey, I need this house built over here," and and they go there to build that house, and like they're attacked, they'll get guns and they'll defend themselves and build the house and then leave. <laughs> like I loved. I like 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 after everything with the Irish, like like I was like. I won't use anybody else. <laughs> I mean, I mean, they're the people you call when when the job has to get done. When you want to get the job done and it's got to be done, you ask an Irishman. Just don't even bother asking anybody else. Almost like like they they will get that job done regardless. And and they they've taken fire. They've they they've been attacked several times. You know, just trying to do their work. Just trying to like they they're just trying to build and. And they'll be attacked, and the, and and they'll get the guns and be like, "Look, if you keep attacking us, we're gonna have to, you know." They've done it several times. That's why people actually start going after the Irish because because the Irish are just so honest and so honorable. You know, they go to do the job and they do the job and they get paid for it, and then they leave. You know, and that's the way it's been for hundreds of years. You know, and and if you attack them, they're gonna attack you back and kill you <laughs> because that's the way it works. And and that's why I loved about the Irish. You know, in the mountains, wherever. You know, I could send them anywhere, and sometimes they would just be attacked by somebody, and they would, you know, they would take fire, and then they would return fire, you know, and, and they were always really honest. You know, it's like, well, they attacked us. You know, what are you going to do? You know, so, so that's why I love the Irish so much, because, you know, if I paid them 50 gold to go do something, I mean, sometimes they would be like, well, we can't do it for the original price. And I was like, oh, that's fine, that's fine. Uh, more money, it's fine. So, I mean, and that's why they love me, too, because, you know, it's word of honor, and you know, my word, you know, I said, pay them, and they would pay them, so, and once you get to be a trusted person with, with LS, then, then after a little bit, it's like, yeah, well, we know who you are, so, you know, they just, they just get the money, they just go, and they don't even have to do all that much work, it's like, okay, and your normal payment is, you know, it's a system, so, you know, and that's why it all worked so well, because we had all these good people that were, watching out for everything and keeping everything going, like the Irish and the British and even the Germans. Like, everybody was, like, watching their little section of the planet, you know, and, and, and happy lives and happy children. You know, everybody just wanted to have their little children running around and and um, and not worry about being stabbed or shot in the back. So, and there was this time, too, when, when, when Rasputin was going around with dirty needles, like, injecting people with opium to make them pass out. You know, or, or doing some other things, like, oh, you know, problems. Yeah, because he was a psychopath. You know, he didn't care. You know, I mean, liars, they become psychopaths. And then it gets really bad. And the next thing you know, they're, they're like, <laughs> you know, or, 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 or like Rasputin, like, like he had, he had three cannon. 
somehow. And like he was shooting them into the rest of the city. And there's people in that city. And he doesn't care. He's just like, <laughs> you know, he's like shelling the houses, trying, he's like, ah! Yeah, like shelling the houses and there's people living in the house and he's trying to kill the people that are invading or coming in to get him. And he's killing the people in the houses more than he's actually hitting the, the, the troops coming in. So he's just killing innocent people. Like crazy. I mean, every shot, n not one shot actually hit the road. Every shot just hit some buildings. And he was just like firing. Like all three cannons. Killing lots of people. Because, you know, he wasn't even checking his shots or anything. He was just... Boom, boom, you know, with, with one of these cannons or something. We had some advanced cannons back there, um, or at least fairly, you know, they could get some distance. I forget if they use cannonballs or not, but uh, smooth bore and all that. So, I mean, yeah, it was a really bad battle. And a lot of people, a lot of, a lot, a lot of innocent women and children died. So, anyway, though, uh, yeah. And Rasputin was around until, like, or the Rasputin gang, basically. It was Rasputin group. They were psychopaths, and... You know, they just didn't care. All they cared about was their opium and stuff. And, and you know, it's like they could have, you know, I don't know. They just didn't care, you know. Anyway, I don't know, power of opium or something. I guess that stuff has a real draw or something. But anyway, but, um, you know, they're just like, fuck it. Blow it all up, you know. So they did.